Imagine stumbling upon a map in the attic of an ancient library, a map not to hidden treasure of gold or jewels, but to a labyrinth of your own heart. What if I told you that within this map lies the secret to breaking free from the chains of unhealthy relationship patterns? Join me as we embark on this journey together, unraveling the mysteries of love and life. Greetings. I'm your guide through the intricate dance of human emotions and connections. Today, we delve deep into the realms of our hearts to confront and transform the patterns that have held us back in love and life. Unhealthy relationship patterns can be like shadows following us unnoticed through life, dictating our moves in silent rhythm. They stem from a variety of sources, past traumas, societal influences, or even our upbringing. Recognizing and understanding these patterns is the first step towards liberation. Armed with psychological strategies, we'll explore how to rewrite the scripts of our lives, transforming our approach to relationships and ourselves. Together, we'll navigate through the tempest of past influences to calm the shores of self-awareness and change. So let's begin. Number one, self-reflection. Begin by journaling your relationship history. Identify patterns and consider their roots. Reflection is a mirror to the soul, offering insights into our deepest selves. Number two, setting boundaries. Learn to say no. Boundaries are the framework within which we build healthy relationships. They protect our well-being and teach others how to treat us. Number three, communication skills. Master the art of assertive communication. It's not just about what we say, but how we say it that shapes our relationships. Number four, self-love. Cultivate a relationship with yourself. Engage in activities that nourish your soul and body. Remember, we cannot pour from an empty cup. Number five, understanding attachment. Explore your attachment style. It influences how we react in relationships. Knowledge here is a powerful tool for change. Number six, managing expectations. Align your expectations with reality. Unrealistic expectations can sabotage relationships before they even begin. Number seven, forgiveness. Practice forgiveness, not only towards others, but also yourself. It's a key to emotional freedom. Number eight, seeking support. Don't journey alone. Therapy support groups and trusted friends can offer guidance and perspective. Number nine, mindfulness. Stay present. Mindfulness reduces stress and increases emotional regulation, helping us to respond, not react. Number 10, final, finally, number 10, empowering choices. Remember, we have the power to choose differently. Each decision is a step towards a healthier pattern. So as we conclude our journey today, remember that transforming unhealthy relationship patterns is not an event, but a process. It requires patience, persistence, and a good dose of courage. By applying these psychological strategies, you're not just changing how you relate to others, but you're also transforming your entire approach to life. So carry forth the insights and tools you've gained. And remember, the path to healthier relationships and fulfilling life is paved with the bricks of self-awareness, change and resilience. Until next time, keep exploring the depths of your heart and your mind. <laughs>